Welcome back, it's OG here. And just for a change, we're playing Juno. If I look at my achievements list, and I scroll down to the rare ones, we can see that there are a few places that no one's landed on yet. And when I say no one, I realize it's not no one, no one, just less than 0.1% of people. And since Boreas, Boreas, Boraz, seems to be the least landed on. Let's do a mission there today. Lucky you, here's a sneak peek of what's to come. I've been working on my rockets and I've encountered a lot of difficulties, but as you can see, this is the Crasher 4. But we're not going to be using the Crasher 4 today. We are now on the Dasher 7. This is the rocket we will be taking today. Much like the Dasher 5, but we have a couple of improvements and hopefully I'll get to show you them, or at least one of them. Boreas is the second innermost world of Eurydos, which is the outermost planet. So we have a long trip ahead of us. Buckle up, buttercups. Here we go. Ooh, I have just realized something. That orbit is the wrong way. That would be bad. If I go around Eurydos that way, it's gonna be very tricky to land on anything. Just 
just changing the plane of my orbit slightly. Ah, which is stupid because the Eurydos moons don't orbit in the standard plane of the solar system. Mmm, I forgot about that. If you look closely, you can see the remnants of our mission to Hypatian here. Right, now it is time to get the inclination of my orbit in sync with that of Boreas, which should be this moon. And it is. I am ahead of Boreas in its orbit, so for now I'm just going to stay with one side of my orbit out further than what its orbit is. And I'm going to do a few laps laps of Eurydos until the moon catches up. Achievement unlocked. Discover Boreas. But the aim of today's mission is not to discover but to land. And land I will, or my name isn't OG, the original Grahamster. Oh yes. Looks pretty dead. Doesn't look like it has an atmosphere. That's good. Then I don't have to deal with atmospheres. Hit the old quick save in case things turn bad. Okay, this is getting pretty. The sun is so beautiful. Boreas, you're putting on a nice light show for us. Whoa! 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 Easy, Tiger. Easy. Okay, so that is not how you do it. Oh man, look at that crater. And the gravity here, she is not big. Wow, the tiniest burn just sends you flying. Uh-oh. Problem. Big problem. I kind of left my second stage 
burning before I sort of jettisoned it and then I got stuck on the front of it and then I was going to die so I so I turned up my own thrusters on this stage and I managed to get away from it all is well I totally intended to do that nothing to see here I brought landing legs. Oh boy, no, wait, no, 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 no. Oh boy. Oh, this is going badly. Okay, that's how not to do it. And I landed. And three parts were destroyed. Well, guys, that just goes to show you win some, you lose some. I got overconfident. I wasn't coming down on the sunny side like I planned. I wasn't watching my rocket speed. I was fooling around. And now, a druid has lost his life. Because of me. And I will have to live with that for the rest of my life. For all druid kind. I did not pass this mission. <laughs> Thank you for joining me through this difficult time. I, I hope to see you again soon. Space exploration must carry on. It's important. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go and hand in my resignation. OG out. <laughs>